For this problem, let's go down to Deb's Deli. There's a very great lunch special going on. You get a choice of a sandwich and a soup or a choice of a sandwich and a salad. We want to figure out how many different lunch combinations we can make there. And in this case, what we've got to focus on is the individual choices. So in the first scenario, we can choose a sandwich and a soup. In the second scenario, we can choose a sandwich and a salad. For the individual combinations or the individual choices, for sandwiches, there are five options. And for soups, there are three. So to find the total number of options of sandwiches and soups, you would multiply the number of individual options together. In this case, five times three. We'll get 15 options for the sandwich soup lunch combination. Let's look at the sandwich salad lunch combination now. Again, we have five options for our sandwiches. And in this case, we have four options for our salads. So for the total number of combinations of sandwiches and salads, we'd multiply the individual number of choices for sandwiches and salads, in this case, five times four, and we'll get 20. At this point, we know there's 15 lunch options that give you a sandwich and soup, 20 options that give you a sandwich and salad. So the total number of lunch combination options will be 15 plus 20, which is 35. So it's going to be very important for these combination permutation problems on test day to remember, focus on the individual outcomes you have for each option. That's going to be key to solving it on test day.